Welcome to the learning module on pressure and temperature basic applications. By the end of this session, you will be familiar with the definition of a pressure and temperature control, also referred to as a switch. The three basic applications are control, monitoring, alarm, and safety. Before we start looking at the basic applications, let's review the definition of a pressure and temperature control. A pressure control is an electromechanical device that opens and closes an electrical circuit when the pressure has reached a preset value. A temperature control is an electromechanical device that opens and closes an electrical circuit when the temperature has reached a preset value. In most fluid processes, temperature and pressure switches provide three main functions – control, monitoring, and safety. The control function is shown by the graph on the left. Switches are used in this function to directly control the pressure or temperature of the application by directly activating or deactivating components of the system. In the event that the pressure or temperature exceeds the limits intended by the system controls, it is common to use a pressure or temperature switch to activate an alarm system. This is shown by the graph in the center. If the application continues beyond the intended limits and becomes a safety risk, an additional switch is used to activate emergency shutdown procedures. Let's look at an example of a typical control function application. The burner starts blowing air into the burning chamber. Oil is sprayed into the chamber and is ignited. The heat increases and steam is generated. Steam vapor is generated and the pressure increases. The lower steam demand causes higher pressure in the chamber and the control switches the fuel supply off. Now let's take a look at an example of a typical monitoring and safety function application. The first steps are the same as with the control function example. The burner starts blowing air into the burning chamber. Oil is sprayed into the chamber and is ignited. The heat increases and steam is generated. Steam vapor is generated and the pressure increases. The lower steam demand causes higher pressure in the chamber and the control switches the fuel supply off. As the pressure keeps increasing due to excess heat in the boiler, the alarm switches on. Thank you for taking the Pressure and Temperature Control Basic Applications module.